sad, Margo, and I need a hug. <laughs> well, okay. Hi girls, it's Monday, and this is my first Monday video. So I'm really excited to be able to ask you guys questions now. Well, one question, but that's okay. So, as all of you may or may not know, there's a new TV show on MTV. And my roommate watches MTV a lot, so I've watched this show a couple times. It's called Sex with Mom and Dad. It's where the kid sits down and talks with their parents about their sex lives, which is kind of interesting. And I kind of was like, mm, let's see what this is about, you know? And it seems kind of cool. It's mostly about people who tell their parents that they're sexually active. The interesting thing about this show is the parents are always saying how they wish that their kids would practice abstinence until marriage. But the parents didn't practice abstinence till marriage. Kind of interesting. As some of you may have noticed, I wear a purity ring or a promise ring or whatever it is you want to call it, I wear it. And I wear it because I choose to wait until marriage for sex. And I've had this decision made most of my life. My parents kind of always wanted me to wait until I was married. And once I started thinking about it and really deciding, you know, my life, my decision, I decided that I did want to wait. I'm not ready for sex, and I won't be for a while. And I'm 18, so I don't want to have sex now, and I'm definitely not going to. So here's my question to you girls. What do you think about waiting till marriage for sex? You don't have to tell me what your personal choices have been. Like, if you're ashamed of anything, like, if you've had sex and you don't want to tell people, or if you haven't had sex and you don't want people to know that you haven't had sex yet, you don't have to tell me. I'm not asking you about your sex life at all. I'm asking about what you think about saving yourself for the one person that you love the most. I'm not saying, you know, good or bad against it. I'm just saying, personally, I'd rather wait until I'm with somebody I know loves me, rather than somebody who might stick around for a couple months, but then again, might leave tomorrow. Not saying that marriages, you know, don't end quickly also, which sucks, but we're not talking about marriages failing. We're talking about sex and when you think it's a good time to start having sex with somebody. Let me know what you guys think. Have a good week.